Hi, my name is Sofia. I'm a mom, economics student and content creator from Finland. Uh, it gets really cold during the winters in Finland, unlike to Paris, which is why I'm focusing on talking about coats and how I like to dress for winters. Today I will show you five of my favorite coats for this autumn winter and share the layering tips I have been perfecting for years trying to stay warm, comfortable, yet chic. Parisian Vibe has invited me today to talk about my favorite coats for 2023 and most importantly how to layer them all while enjoying beautiful Paris. I start all of my days with coffee. I love coffee. And in Paris, I often go to Café Kitsune, just opposite of the, excuse my French, Jardin de Tuileries. In winter, coats become your main signature piece. This is the first thing people greet you in. And I have a lot of coats in my wardrobe, a collection I have been carefully curating over the past 10 years. This is my first coat and my first autumn winter outfit. The first thing I would like to talk about is the length of the coat. I definitely prefer mine to be very long. It's easier with what you wear underneath. My choice of the length is not only aesthetic, it's rather practical as well. A very long coat allows me to wear a wider variety of outfits underneath as it keeps the whole of my body warmer. I'm quite tall, though I think such length of the coat can also suit someone more petite especially if you pair it with heels or, or platforms. I love to keep my color palette neutral and in this particular outfit I wanted to keep the tones gray and very subtle. And this coat is a beautiful dark gray color and I paired it with more masculine wide gray trousers uh, to let the coat be the feminine touch to this outfit. When I come to Paris, I eat more sweets than ever. And one delicacy that I love is macarons. So here I decided to treat myself with some macarons. And this time I tried rose petal, which I love, and the pistachio was my favorite. For the second outfit, I chose a creamy monochrome look, which I love. It instantly gives a very put together and elegant impression and what I think is most important is to not be afraid to mix different textures and materials and even be brave enough to wear very delicate silk during the colder months. The most important thing is to just layer correctly. So for this look I chose this midi length silk skirt that has a beautiful flow and underneath I can wear stockings or tall boots, like in this case. And I paired it with a chunky knit and a mohair fully lined coat. I'm very specific about materials and I'm loyal to my favorite materials, which includes, for example, silk and cashmere. During winters in Finland, it gets really cold. I'm not gonna be shy to wear my favorite materials. It's just all about layering and pairing them up correctly. This coat is a little bit oversized, which is very convenient because then you can layer a lot underneath. And it's fully lined, which I love because it makes it easier to put it on and take it off and it doesn't get stuck on top of the knit. This look is a more casual look that I would wear when I take my children to school or when I go grocery shopping after my work day. Uh, a cashmere set is something I wear repeatedly all the time at home and when I casually just go downtown or take care of errands really fast. I've always loved the Ugg boots and it's it might be a little unexpected pick for this look but I love the platform because during fall winter season in Finland it gets really wet on the ground and muddy and slushy so a platform makes it easier for the shoe to stay clean. Cashmere is a very nice material that I always try to invest in and have a nice set for each winter season 
And for this look, I wanted to keep it monochrome to make it feel very elegant. And on top, I put this coat that's a very feminine and that I and that's why I like to dress it down with this more casual boot and set. I wanted to include an all black look because I think it's the most worn look I wear during winter. Black is always elegant and chic and for this look I chose a very feminine black coat with a belt and paired it with a classic white shirt and black trousers for a very timeless and easy look. My style is quite feminine and I always add something that makes me feel very feminine to make the outfit feel like myself. So I never pair very oversized or chunky tops with, the bo with a very masculine bottom. So for this last look, I wanted to feature a shorter coat because I love this more preppy look and I always love to wear also skirts and dresses and I think this is a fun flirty look for that. And what I've learned during the cold months in Finland is that I try to stay really warm on my feet and that's why I chose a nice merino wool sock to keep my feet warm and this chunky loafer when it gets even more colder you can just add a pair of tights and then you will stay more warm and for this look I wanted to match the socks with the coat so it's a gray look I feel like gray is a really big color this season and I layered the shawl that completes the look on top of the coat for an extra layer of warmth. When it gets even more cold, a beanie is mandatory and I have very sensitive skin, therefore I also prefer to have a really soft cashmere beanie close to my skin. My winter dressing tips include opt for monochrome looks if you want to have an elegant look in an easy way. Mix something masculine with a feminine detail to keep the look interesting. Opt for more oversized coats because it's easier to layer more layers underneath. Don't sacrifice your style or your favorite materials just because it's cold. It's all about learning how to work with different materials and layering. Longer lengths and lining in the coat will give you more versatility with what you wear underneath and will keep you warm. I hope you enjoyed my staying warm tips for the upcoming winter season.